Norfolk police said officers were called to the estate shortly before 3 p.m. in response to reports of a collision involving two cars. The Duke of Edinburgh, 97, was not injured in the two-vehicle crash, according to a statement from Buckingham Palace. Witness Roy Warren said he heard the Duke tell police he was dazzled by the sun. Mr. Warren, who helped to free the Duke from the wreckage, said the royal's first words to him while he lay trapped were, my legs, where should I put my legs? But after being freed, the heroic Duke managed to walk over to officers at the scene and ask them, is everyone else all right? The Duke, 97, was driving a Land Rover Freelander, which flipped over after it was hit by another car, a Kia, when he pulled out of a private driveway onto a busy A road. But the first picture of the crash scene shows the extent of the damage to the car and how the Duke was lucky to escape the incident unscathed. The photograph reveals how the car had been impacted on its passenger side. The inside of the car shows two airbags, one in the front and one in the rear, inflated after being set off from the impact of the crash. The windows on both the passenger side of the vehicle and the driver's side were both smashed out, leaving empty, dented frames and glass smashed everywhere. The driver's door had been trapped shut by the impact of the smash. The picture shows the left-hand side of the vehicle's exterior dented and scrapped, likely caused by the car landing on its left-hand side after it was flipped over. Extensive damage can be seen, including scratches to paintwork and scuffed and dented wheel arches on the car. On the left-hand panel of the car, skate marks, likely endured from the car skidding on the floor, appear to be at least 6 to 8 inches long, with the door handle also dented significantly. The Range Rover is likely to have been reinforced for use by the royal family. Eyewitnesses have said how Philip, who retired from public duties in 2017 but remains active, was left shocked following the accident. In a statement three hours after the incident, Buckingham Palace said the Duke of Edinburgh was involved in a road traffic accident with another vehicle this afternoon. The Duke was not injured. The accident took place close to the Sandringham estate. Local police attended the scene. A palisade added, he saw a doctor as a precaution, and the doctor confirmed he was not injured.